Genji versus Foul. Round one, game one, looks like. Slovenia, potentially. Let's see. This is a game where I'm actually, Paul, I'm actually really interested in, into seeing if Genji plays the same way he did yesterday. Where Very you fast, see him, extremely fast. He said he was allergic to signs. You know, less information for him, sometimes the better. We do see Foul seeing some yellow signs there. We do see both of them seeing the same yellow signs, which would indicate Slovenia. You do get those signs in Slovenia and like Croatia, Monty, but with Gen 4 and this architecture, you see a Slovenia guess here. And we'll see both players Trevor, guess Slovenia. Gingy, average guess time of 11 seconds. Oh, we've got our stream. Oh, oh just a yeah. slight pause there, but Foul about to lock in as well, both in similar location, similar region. Nothing too much 11 going second on. Yeah, average, yeah, guess, average time. guess time, 11 seconds on the side of Jinji. Now that one, I believe. He's been pushing the pace hard. He foul, controls the pace. Foul at 25.4 seconds. Yeah, and that's, you know, you put the pressure on. Sometimes, if you feel confident, might as well do it. Let's see what round two has to offer here. And it has a beautiful location. Not South Korea, but it is Peru. So not as beautiful. Let's see, 1.5x damage. Foul versus Jinji. You know, one would say Foul has the moving advantage, and especially in the you know, settings like this, where you know you're, you're guaranteed. To, and we see the Genji oh, doing the same thing in. again. Fast, aggressive approach, Trevor, living up to it's not just his stats, but the aura that he's begun to create around himself. Very similar region here with both players, with only two seconds left to go. Look, Lima. It would've been enough. Always look, Lima. There. <laughs> it's it's uh, it's kind of the name of the game sometimes. 834 points. Foul's going to like that on and the 1.5x in round two. It was aggressive, but it's also risky, I feel like, to, to make that guess. Because as soon as you make a guess, you give the, your opponent 15 seconds to find information, which could be death. But, you know, it's it's worked out for him this far. So, so let's see. far, it's worked out. We have seen a couple times where it stumbled him. But more for than not, if we're looking at the percentage, percentages, I think when he's acting fast and moving first, it's usually a positive outcome for him. Exactly. And let's see how positive his guess can be here in... India. Like that, Trevor. Gingy and foul. Round Gingy three, foul. 2x damage. <laughs> He's going He's straight, already. I mean, this looks like a pretty distinct area of India. Like, I feel like if you've straight. seen this before, you would know it. Because I have never seen coverage like this in India personally. But, you know, if you have 25,000 games played, maybe you have. And he's giving Foul no time to get a guess off. And he's going in a similar region and not too far from the other player there. Absolutely right. The location slightly southeast of both players. The double damage, though, means Foul gets another 522 points of damage going towards his opponent, Jinji. This is what it has led up to be so far. High level gameplay here by both players. Measured. Measured. High level gameplay. Round four, looks like. Tit for tat, as they say. We're back, you know, very fitting location here for the Americas Regional. So we do look to be in North America here for both of these players. The question is, is it Canada or US? That's for them to find out and for me to watch and see. Looks more like, we have an area code there. Uh, he will not zoom on the area code. Let's see, Genji is zooming into Oklahoma here for us. Kansas is his final guess. No back plate on that. We do have the American flag. Looking at the plates, plates are are blurred, but plates are useful because you can still see the design five seconds on the clock. Thou has no guess down. Genji, he's in Missouri, very close again. Who will be closer? And it will be, looks like Mu maybe has a slight advantage, or er, Thou, apologies, has a slight advantage there. 4,000 points, down goes Jinji, foul, taking another win for the round. Let's keep going. Moving to the halfway point now, round number five. It's been a fast game so far, which was what our expectation was, considering we've got Jinji on the server, but foul right now proving he has the resistance necessary and is actually in the lead by close to 2,000 points. Yep, and going into round five here, looks like a typically small country in Montenegro. We'll see if that is the case but both players will move and find out. The question is here is, you know, with Foul having such a 2,000 point lead here, you keep getting these smaller countries. North Macedonia Foul? makes a lot of oh, sense I actually. Thought Foul wanted to move first. Oh, we do yeah. have a North Mass flag there and that does make sense. Um, that yellow flag there and no antenna. This is an, a, again, a very small country. Gingy analyzing everything, internalizing it, painting a picture beyond the picture in front of him. And he does lock in off the back of it all. Foul now with 10 seconds to react. Very minimal points here. Seems calm, think. scanning around. Minimal points. Looks like it's going to be the case. 3x damage though. Could make... Oh, is he going to get it? Yeah, he already had it down, yeah. Ooh, a little more south there. Gingy there. 
Bouncing back. Three, three, three. 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 That one in the chat. Keep Lucky going number here. three. And looking at round six, we're going to be breaking the streak of small countries here because we are going to be joining ourselves in Australia. Some beautiful eucalyptus trees here. I bet this road smells very nice, Paula. Yeah, are we, are we surrounded by eucalyptus here? Surely. Okay. I guarantee you... Uh, nice menthol awakening mm. for one of our players. Let's see if their guesses are just as nice as the smell. Round six, one minute on the clock, moving. Foul and Gingy. Both, both players going, going in the same, same direction, direction. Think, yes, but foul slightly ahead. Hear the tip. Yeah, you can hear the tapping. Tap, Gingy tap, 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 with, that, with that gamer stance. Are those, were those bees there? But were there was that a beekeeping? Uh, <laughs> that, that be. There's a lot screen? of really cool bee locations in this game. Sometimes you get hordes of bees following you. Kind of scary oh. low-key. I mean, this is, looks like one of those roads where you just, if you're not going to find information, you have to make a good region yeah, you guess. you've got to make a big region guess. And I do Gingy's like... going towards Melbourne. I like the Victoria. I, I think both players do end up going Victoria here. I'm not sure where you would end up... In, in, 20 seconds. You end up going... And we see a pull here. Any information here for foul with 14 seconds left. Gingy's going to lock it in. I just, 10 seconds remain for foul. I expect both players to go Melbourne or er, Vic here. And we see a Sydney. Ooh, that's a here. big difference. Could this be big point swing in the direction of one of our players? 3.5x damage. Ooh. Foul is closer. But how much by? 1,000 points. And that is one of those things where, you know, again, you click capital, Canberra, and you get closer. But that's a... Uh, that, I mean, that's a very rural Australia. It's very, very hard to reason, I guess, locations like that. So, you know, props you know, to both players coming away, you know, still alive from that round seven. Going into our seventh round now, Trevor. Four like X damage. This is where the multis have really bu have, have built up at this point. They're talking to each other down there, it seems. It looks like. Oh, yeah? Like, oh, you going Melbourne on that? No, I'm just kidding. All right, let's see. A little let's bit of see. drama. A little bit of drama. Gamesmanship. Let's see what round seven here. It looks like a colo. Let's let them move and see what we have. Let's let our players decide. Gingy, 3,000 points down. Foul, We have a Mexican guest here. And he's going to instant send it. And, I, you know, he's probably right. It, it's a big send. This really heaps the pressure back onto Foul. Looking at the copyright here, 2023 copyright, new coverage that probably was released soon. And we have two Chiapas guesses, or close to Chiapas Tabasco here. And it will be Campeche. Tabasco region around that ends up being quite spicy. 2.1k damage. And this is so close, really. I mean, only a 500 point difference. And we're going into round eight. And you know, these later rounds equal bigger points. As always, multi stack up, so do the points. Big multi, big damage. Big, big country, big damage. Trevor. Big country. Which one's up next? We've got the USA, America. America. And you know, both players are, you know, North American. I'm not sure who has the advantage here in the States. Jinji is from California and he does have that West Coast, you know, I think advantage, but this will not be the West Coast. Let's see where this will end up being. Both players zooming into the bus. This, it, um, usually when you have bus stops, you're going to be in a more urban area, especially in the US with a uh, very limited uh, transport. I've never taken a bus in the US. We I have, have no idea what it's like. Illinois guess here. Yeah, I don't think. Uh, I, well, ooh, some area codes potentially. Let's see. 30 seconds left. Trevor, you have ever taken the bus in the US? I took a bus to work a couple times, yeah. Okay, nice. Both players are in Illinois here, yeah. so. Not going to be much going on here in round number eight. Oh, wait. Oh, we switched to Chicago? Switching to Chicago by foul. Still. Does it pay off? Let's see. Does he pay for his mistakes? Three seconds, Paula. Will be Could be some substantial Ooh. points. Oh! That will probably. That's almost a 5K! Foul! No. 0.5x damage, 1.9k going the way of Gingy. And that is a great switch last second Huge for foul. Huge switch. Huge play. Massive, massive, massive play. Massive switch, massive points. And a huge reward at the end of it for foul. He can go confidently striding. Gingy is in despair it's right now nine. with only a thousand points left to his name. Going in round nine. And this will be Arge. And you know, actually I'm not sure who has the advantage in Argentina. But, you know, who doesn't have the advantage as a person up 2,500 points? I expect Gingy to move fast here. He doesn't like losing those rounds. Yep, look, here we go. Yeah, and he's Straight to Arge, straight to region, and... And you have to expect Foul to also know that he's going to be doing this. So he's going to have to be playing super fast here. I was expecting the instant lock. He didn't. But he, a bit later than expected, but there it is. He had to 15 find seconds there, 20 seconds. A road. Foul, do you expect him to be in the, end up in a similar place, Trevor? I think so. Wait. 
Why? Genji does not look like he likes his guest at all. He, he's oh, there's covering a big his face. difference in he distance here with oh. 5x damage. He just, Genji might have done he the just fatal blow. Yes, yes, it's enough. 6.7k, Trevor. Wow. Oh, Gingy, it doesn't matter if you're on 1k HP if you play like that. Not it's playing gingerly at all. Not at all. And that that's just one of those things where consistency wins. I keep saying it, but, you know, it's kind of about those games, you know, those guesses later in the games that really do matter the most, and that's what we keep seeing game after game. And, you know, Val played really, really well there, but... Argentina guess was not enough, and Gigi Argentina, takes game one. We've seen a lot of Argentina over these three days, and some big guesses in different directions. A big country, big points, we know that, and Gingy, the proof is in the pudding. Yep, exactly, and I think his I think his play style, especially against Foul, might, might bode well, but we will see. Let's keep the clock running. Game two, this is no move. The players do just get one single 360 panorama, and this is it. Let's see what they can do with that in round one of no move. We do have a train here, or like a railway here. Let's see. Little bridge overlooking a train track. You see Spain zoom in here. Foul in now, wanting to push the pace. Let's see how Gingy can react on the back foot. Going in a very similar location, region I should say. Both in northern Spain here, minimal points. It was just Madrid. And it was <laughs> north of Madrid. Met is only seven. Seven points. Seven. 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 Round two. That is marginal. Will this be the same case? Let's keep it going. This is no move. You get one 360 panorama. You have long dashed white outer lines here with French pole tops, it seems there. So the pointy pole top there that is French. Reaching, is Genji gonna come in an island here? Or is that just a space plonk and he'll move it? Let's find out. 48 seconds. Foul still looking for anything that can help Raging Gas because he will know it's France. And both of them, again, in a very similar region with 40 seconds left. Foul scanning for something. But in the end, you probably just end up clicking center because France is not that easy. Genji is showing the audience that he might want to go northwest here and he does. Nope, he's switching back. He's not committing. Eight seconds left. Where will he go? Will he do it? He's he's hovering over it. He's gonna he's gonna stay there. He's staying where he is. Foul move first, and this time it pays off. 515 damage. Right now, this this game two is looking a bit like game one, but we saw what happened when those multis built, and Jinji had the better guess later. He took it, but nonetheless, foul getting off to a good start. Yep, as always, I feel like Jinji is constantly coming from behind. So for him to have that game one game one advantage too is pretty big for him. Let's see what round three has to, has for us. Looks very encouraging for either player. You probably end up going double damage in round number three. No move, just a three sixty panorama. And Gingy now saying, Northern. "I like the look of Ireland slash Northern Ireland." He is going north of Ireland, or north not Northern Ireland, but north. Of Ireland, yes. And we see a, in the north of we Ireland. We see a Wales guess here. And a there Wales was, guess from Fal. There was a different language. I, I actually not sure if it was Irish or Welsh. Yeah. But uh, looks like both players are thinking separate things here. So 30 seconds left, and Fal is saying it the is going to be Welsh. damage could be a reasonable hit. Could be some strong points. And Gingy is staying in Ireland. In either direction, Trevor. Who's but I'm not right? sure which way it's going to go. 17 seconds left. It looks like Fal is scanning. Fal really thinks he knows this road. And he's scanning for the for the cities or the Ten towns on that. Left. Can he not find it because it's not in Wells? Five. Because, because it's just too tiny. He just One goes second. closer. Sort of a region guess by Fal. It was he's Wells. closer. Much closer with double damage, Trevor. That'll be 1.6k damage going the way of Gingy. Wow. And it does look like this is shaping up like game one, but can Fal hold yeah. on? I mean, we've seen it before and before. And, you know, even in day one, you know, Fal only really made like a couple bad guesses and ends up really meaning everything. So hopefully that, you know, for him, that might not be the case. Hopefully that's not the case for him. Let's see and what round four is live right here. Looks like low cam Japan. You will see, you know, immediately you'll see both players zoom in on this telephone pole right here directly in front of us to see if there's anything there. We do see foul that does. foul. Genji follows. Genji is there thing, but 
Val going quickly to the map, but then removes it. Jinji Looking doing the same. Any sort of plates that they're able to read on that pole that gives them the region or the Val prefecture. Val his head. Val going, thinking south. Jinji is locking in. South, 10 seconds left. Val doesn't know what to commit. He's going outside Tokyo oh, here. Oh, he's going more quite north. Quite a Sendai. difference with 2.5x. Is he Three going to go for south? Left. He's, he's staying in Tokyo. And he's right. Oh, Val, what a play. You're not on the money, but you're close, and you will be rewarded oh. handsomely, putting Jinji on 155 hit points. Wow. And he's... Look at the score. 6K to 155, an untouched foul. Flawless. The so Canadian far. shines bright. I mean, armor unscathed. You know, the score is 1 to 0, but really, Foul has held control of both of these games, I think. So. And in and going into just round 5, where 3x multi healthy, but with, with 3x, if Foul plays smart, this should be a gimme. He should have this. He should draw it up 1 1. Yeah. But again, you know, we've seen Never these, that simple, though, is it? Never that Trevor? simple. If it's that simple, we will all be there. Let's see, round 5. And, you know, this isn't actually the worst case scenario for Foul. You know, you kind of are looking for smaller, more region guessable countries that you can, you know, maybe have studied before. And then this country right here with this poll, this will be Colombia. And, you know, it's better than Russia. It's better than Indonesia, maybe. But let's see what Fal likes to do with this. Because it's, you know, you get one slot. And we'll see Jinji make this very, very just instant guess here. Not locked in just yet. Both in a very... But Jinji just wait, flirting they're both outside so close to each other, of Medellin. Paula. Oh yeah, both so close to each other. But, both, but with 3x damage... It's, I mean, you can easily pick up 155 points here, even yeah, if you're like in the same it. city. He's gonna Ten seconds. run this clock down, really refine his spot. Standing but will it be roads. enough? Five seconds, Paula. Three left. Foul, have you done enough? He, he might have. That's gonna be it. 420 points! 420, smoke that! <laughs> <laughs> that was what finishing in there to take Jinji out, and we're going to game three. You took that one, Trevor, and you ran with it just as Foul did. That's our first perfect of the tournament, I yeah, think. That, I mean, that was... I, I, he was really close to bossing in game one, too, so... I mean, Foul was just playing out of his mind, and that's the reason why, you know, he was a top eight competitor last, you know, in the World Cup Finals. He was there for a reason, and... You know, Foul is, uh, is laughing. I'm not sure, you know, what he thinks is funny, but, uh... Series drawn up now, Trevor. Yeah, I mean, this is... I mean, dude, this is just high level. Uh, you just have to appreciate this gameplay here by both players. Absolutely. You know, Jinji is playing... The fact is, Jinji really didn't play that game bad at all. You know, he didn't really make any bad guesses, and, you know, Foul is just kind of right there, just kind of slowly hedging away. Let's see what game three is. And this will be back to the moving. So they will be able to press that W key. And, um... What, Game number one. three, back to move, everybody. Best of five. Let's see, let's start the game Winning off. Winning this map does not put you in the finals, but it puts you one step closer. It gives you that edge. Yes, it will. It means you can potentially avoid an NMPZ. Looks Baltic. This looks like a Baltic sign here. You know, you can actually tell what country it is based off the orientation, but um, and it looks like it's their foul knows the orientation of those signs because he is instant locking Estonia. And we see a left of Wayne, I guess, here, because you do have the A-frame pull here, but maybe Foul does... Could it be confident. a strong round one for one player, very possibly. And it's it is! Good. It's a strong start for Foul. And he's just playing That's really well. That's 1.2k off the rip! He's playing so well, Paula. It's almost unbeatable. You know, he did get that, Genji did get that, you know, game one win. But, you know, just confidence is, you know, oozing from Foul right now. But Genji, he's one of the best players so in the world. locked in. Yes. And, that was one of those players that you've, you know, he he's he's always locked in, you know, even barely the World a, Cup. Barely a change in his expression this whole time, Trevor. Round two. Let's keep it going. This is moving. This is moving. Both players doing what they can. Vegan. Secure their there. future both in that final. Are gonna zoom in. Trying to find where they are in. Foul likes that body of water. There's is he going to end up putting Jinji in a body bag? We'll have to see. Luckily, there's very few bodies of water in Sweden, so you can line this up, right? Th there's very, very few bodies, especially in this area here. There's not very many bodies of water. Yeah. <laughs> so maybe they're both... Oh, it's Max North, or just more Max North. Max North. I was very confused for a second, because I was like, that's something I know is just <laughs> not true, anti-truth. And then I'm looking, I'm looking at your face, and I'm like, oh, he's memeing me. 
a little, you know, just a little. So a little put, trolling. put me in a little trap. Yeah, a little, a little as bit. As you love to do, Trevor. I've never done that. <laughs> <laughs> Round three. Let's keep it going here. Let's keep it rolling. Round number three, two X damage. Looks like... Maybe Gingy needs to invoke the power of the spicy ice. Remain cool, calm, and collected more than ever if he wants to bring this game in his favor. Yes. Yep. And, you know, off the rip to me, this does look like we're going to be... We're, yeah. Once again, Mexico. back outside Tabasco. This kind of region of Mexico, I think Southern Mexico is pretty distinct. The question is like, do you go Veracruz? Do you go Chiapas? Do you go Campeche? Where do you go here? Three seconds left. Someone, they're in different regions. We have a Veracruz and a Campeche. Yeah, quite the distance here on 2x dam. Ah, but Tabasco. luckily for both, the location splits them in two. And you know, that's the first points he's lost in a while there by foul. Let's keep going to round four. Yep. Foul have. is human after all. We do have a Norway. No way, Norway. World Cup jewels, 2.5x damage, round four of 10. Foul in the lead by about 1.2k. Gingy wanting to push push the pace here. Go south Norway, just outside Oslo, and he locks it in. Foul, how do you respond? Do you agree or disagree? Where will you go? Yep. In a very, very, similar very location. similar and very few points again. Both players. Playing very smart Geo Guesser right now. That's 78 points. Down goes foul. Not, you know, not anything too crazy, but you know, as we've seen, people do survive with 78 points. Round five, 3x damage. Looks like we're back in India. Not sure who has the advantage. We do, I think we did see them have an India prior. They both had a pretty similar region guess there, so I see if that's also the case here. Foul. And Jinji looking at... So oh, in fact, the sign that Jinji's looking at gives him an instant read. He think he's Apollo. thinking Kerala. Oh, he's yeah, looking to go on no, holiday. It, yeah. I mean, it, he just read information that gave him the exact province there. Oh, and this could be big. It, I mean, it's... If Foul doesn't have the same... It's, it, oh, yeah, oh, look no. at this. That's massive points because Jinji is right. 3x damage. Oh, oh, and oh it's max the location, north. I mean, Jinji is closer. 3x damage, but it's not going to be too big. 9 two, one Yeah, I mean, he did get the, you know... I wow. promise there, but it could have been way worse if it was, you know, more south there. But foul, not seeing that sign, but still getting away scot-free for the most part. And wow, this is getting intense. Past the halfway point, we are going into round six. It's going to be 3.5x. Even now between our two players, just about 200 points separating the two. Foul, barely in the lead. We have a little Italy action here. Players. We're in a very urban setting, which means lots of signs, lots of information. I think Foul has the advantage when it comes to info. We'll see. Foul, 10 seconds before moving, and he's it seems that he's happy room. with what he's seen so far. This is move. I don't need to, he says. And again, you know, both players. Oh, but it's Gingy that locks in first. As always. And we For Marta Boss, does that mean something to you, Foul? He's scanning eastern, east of Rome here. He's going even. Three he's seconds. Scanning three seconds. Wow. Maybe barely anything separating the two there. Yep. Only Coming out round six. Is, and we're getting to these high multis again. And it's just it's just kind of neck and neck. It yep. is. Even even when it was six thousand to hundred, it was still neck and neck. You know, like the guesses were still really close. Let's see who will take a game two advantage, or game three advantage, round seven. Looks like South Africa here. Looks pretty north. Let's see. One move. minute on the clock. We are on a white road, which means not a main road here. So the question is, who can find it? And we Four do see, rounds remain, including this we do one, see Trevor. see a Joe Bird guess here by and, Gingy immediately. Yeah, Gingy pushes hard. The thing is, Foul knows exactly where Gingy just guessed. Because if you guess that quickly in South Africa, you basically just click Pretoria. And so he'll probably do a similar thing here. He is trying to refine his position though, hoping yep. to maybe eke some points mm. out, but no, Gingy closer. Quadruple damage, 848. Eight. Wow. And you know, 4,500 to 4K. Let's see if Foul will be caught in 4K in round eight. <laughs> Round eight, exactly, Trevor. 4.5x damage, three rounds left. These are big multipliers now. 
Both players, even Gingy's just squeaked the lead. Does he want to push the pace here? Does he want to act first? Does we he have... want to refine? Mm, we have a holy pull. Maybe... Foul, going central hungry. Let's see. Gingy, oh, wait, going Gingy, fast. Wait, Gingy, did Gingy not see the holy pull? This is big. Wait, do we have a holy pull there? Okay. Oh, but then he corrects. Oh my god, if he didn't go back in the beginning there, Corrects that to Central Hungary, keeps himself alive. That, because if he had stayed on France, that, that would have been GG. was almost a massive blunder there, you know? If he didn't go back and, and see that, that pole there, he definitely... You, you do not have those holy poles there in France. But you do get them when you're hungry. Round nine. Penultimate round, Trevor. And wow. This is what a way... What a location for round nine here. In... You, Indonesia. Yes. Yes! Woo! Let's go, Pilot. We made it. 5x damage. The penultimate round of game three. We're moving. And it's anyone's game when the multis are this big. And we know Indonesia can be a tricky country. So many islands, so many choices. Trevor, do you think one of our players is going to have the edge here now? I always give information edge to foul. I'm not sure which players here do know their Kabupaten or, you know, poles or things like that. But Jinji, of course, as always, going to be the first person to make a guess. And he's going just in Sumatra here, north of Sumatra. Let's see where Foul ends up plonking. We have 30 seconds left on the clock for him to find any. When you have this much information, it's smart to actually let the time run out. And we have a, we have a Kali oh, guess here. Oh, there guess is here. a big difference we have, we have between a game here for someone, Paul. Uh, Trevor. We have a game here for someone. Locked in on Foul. Jinji, how do you respond? Will Jinji stay? He's switching to Kali. He's switching to, but it's still Cali. a lot of distance, It's Trevor. still a lot. We have a West Kali and South Kali. One second left. Who's it gonna be? Oh, oh that's it! Foul! Oh. When you do it like that, you do it big. That's 8.4k damage. Wow. And you will be the one taking the lead. He's just putting on a clinic right now. He is putting on a clinic, Trevor. I could not put it better myself, but look at that. The face I mean, of stone does I mean, not react. It, I mean, that's just his personality. And if we actually look, I think at the greater picture here, at rounds one, you know, Jinji might have that game one win, but Rounds one, I think it's a clear foul right now. Oh, foul. Look at you. Looking across your shoulder at Jinji as he talks to the admin, like he's thinking, kid, you ain't losing because of your PC. <laughs> You're losing because I'm winning. He said, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, but listen, we, you know, we've seen time and time again. I keep saying this, but you know, it's not over. It's not over until it's over. Jinji may be saying, so admin, check him PC. Check him PC. <laughs> you know the reference. <laughs> of course. I wasn't sure if that would fall uh, short. That's a very common, uh, especially as you guys are seeing. Wow. All right, let's it. just quickly set the scene before we go into game number four, no move. Jinji started off this tournament with a bang. He ended up going three and zero to secure a spot at the World Cup and get into this semi-final. Foul, he went two to one at the start of the tournament. We thought he could maybe put off the 3-0, but he couldn't. Nonetheless, he booked his ticket to the World Cup and the semi-final. In that sense, Foul sort of went from being one of the favorites to still a favorite, but going up against some of the toughest competition here in the form of Jinji. Now, Foul is one game away from securing a spot in the final. Jinji's back is now against the wall, Trevor. Exactly, and you're going into move, no move though, which is kind of Jinji's territory, but Foul, you know, it's foul, and he's uh, he's been here before, and uh, we'll see if he can keep keep it up. In round one of game four, no move. You get one 360 panorama. That is all you get. We do have tons of information here for the players to guess off of, though, with bodies of water, road lines. Let's see, we'll see Jinji AZ into Norway with these road lines, obviously. As does foul. Foul even more so. Oh, I thought I was going to see a lock. Who's going to lock first? It's like they're competing to move first. I'm looking for water east right now that lines up. Foul finding a road with also another, you know, land on the east. Is that ever the and right road? It's foul locking it in. Yo, his body of water low key lines up. I'm not saying it's the right road, but I wouldn't be surprised. It's not a non zero chance it is. It would be quite impressive though. Another 5k, a second 5k of the tournament potentially, Trevor? Nope. Nope. Just also. Not today. <laughs> yeah, it's, I mean, like, you know, again, you know, like like Sweden, also doesn't really have that many bodies of water. So it's kind of, especially with mountains nearby. So it's kind of, maybe. All right. Yeah, round two. Let's keep going. Ooh, are we back in the Northern Europe here? Looks like it could be a Sweden or something of the like. 
Round two. No move. Game four. 1.5x damage. Gingy now, perhaps. I wonder if you actually go France here now. Feeling the pressure. A Denmark, a Czechia. Yeah, we have a Denmark and a Czechia here by Gingy. With his long car antenna, we set, we have architecture too south. And both players going Denmark. I do like a Denmark. I like a Denmark and I like a France. I don't think I like anything else. And we see both players going Denmark because maybe the architecture south does look more Danish and vegetation overall. I would agree it does look pretty Danish. But let's see. Genji going for a water hedge here. Denmark. And it's northern Denmark. Genji closer with 1.5x damage. He'll send 341 points uh, of damage towards Foul. Yeah, I mean, look how close this game is right now. And, you know, it is only round three now. But also, exciting news, I think, for the, the tournament here. Exciting news for some players in the community watching at home, especially if you're a New Zealand enjoyer, because we have our first New Zealand lock of the tournament. I'll give one big 360, and let's get in. Two, round three, two X damage. I'm not sure, we, you know, we haven't seen any NZ locks of the tournament so far, so I'm not sure who actually bodes well here, but that's about to find out. We, I think we just saw Genji zoom in to South Island. Genji sticking Genji to what he South knows. Island. That was about a 13 second. Both players on West Coast of Have, South Island. In terms of guest time, Fao having to react, and he's going much further north with 2x damage. We could see some damage here. Man, some Genji. significant damage. Genji close. And yep, that's, that's going to be 1.2k. Wow. But again, you know, it's, it's only round four. Only round four. And look, again, what a beautiful location. This looks a very, like a very distinct part of Turkey here. Turkey. Um, we have the speckled Turkey pavement, wide Gen 4. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it rolling, Trevor. Keep Not these sure guys under the gun. The Make advantage. sure that they can perform the highest level. Let's see. Foul still showing so little emotion, just completely Central. locked Ooh, in. Completely separate parts of Turkey here. We have an Eastern. I actually almost... I... I... I oh. Genji just moved more East. But Foul is committing East. And he's even showed the audience another road he thought could potentially could be. So I lean towards his confidence there. Genji hedging more Central. It's a big Who's difference right? right now. Five seconds. Three now. Genji... Are you more on the Gigi. money? Yes, you are. That is a great guess. And with 2.5x multi, that's going to be 3.2k. Wow. In the and barrel and shot. If he would have just guessed on the road, he would have got the 5k, it looks like. He just kind of guessed in the mountains there. It is just a white road there. But Foul now in the position that he's put Gingy in twice. Exactly. Yeah, and this is not the position you want to be in either. But let's see what round five is. And you know, I feel like both these players in, this, in, in their lineups here I've had a lot of India, and it's not stopping yet, it looks Triple like. Triple damage in India, Trevor. I'm going to stand up, buddy. Yeah, I mean, that's... But again, both Oy. these players, they, they keep making consistently good region guesses in India, so like... Jinji going fast, plonking in east, not committing just yet, looking for more information, looking at the poles in the distance. Makes him adjust, goes a bit more central. Foul yet to open his map. Do we see... Foul, take it to game five in an MPZ, or does he make it to the finals right here? If he does win this game, he does advance to the fi finals today. Reaching the halfway point now, Foul still yet I'm to open up. his map. Jinji sticking around that central location that he originally picked. He's refining slightly, but Foul. no big moves. Foul still yet to open the map, just processing. Doing the map. Analyzing, opens the map, zooms in. And where will he plonk? Will it be much different at all it's close. than Gingy? It's close. Oh, I don't know. With 3x damage, Trevor. Where's oh, that put us, Gingy? Game. Just closer. That should be game. You are absolutely right, Trevor. 1.6k wow. damage. It's time for NMPZ. Both semifinals are giving us an NMPZ matchup. We are spoiled. Wow. And, you know, coming down to India there, that... Yeah, you know, it happens. That's when the a, best of the best come head to head, Trevor, it's almost guaranteed at the highest level of GeoGuessr that we get the highest level matchups, that we have to go to NMPZ 
to decide who is the winner, who is the top dog in the server at any given moment. And once again, we are treated to that now. And this is um, you know, NPZ, this is where you see the most blunders. This is where you see the best exciting guesses because you might see people go around continent. It's so common <laughs> because it's so We've hard. Seen it. It's seen so it. difficult. People underestimate how difficult it really is, especially when there's hard locations. And you know, sometimes uh, some locations are much harder than others. Let's see. Are oh, we ready? I'm seeing a preview of where we're starting off, Trevor. Maybe we want to show everybody at home. Show everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, everyone at home, America's Regional Finals, Day 3, Semi-Final. It's the last game, Game 5, between Gingy and Foul. NMPZ, Game 5, Round 1. Looks like a Guat. Let's see if both players get Guatemala here. You know, I could see maybe a player goes I could see maybe an Ecuador guess here, but I think with the pan you have to go Guat because it does look like going it's straight to and it Guat. looks like southeast Guat. It looks like Foul, I, where did Foul? I didn't see where Foul went. There is these like I think banana plantations that are very distinct. And he locks it in. Gingy thinks he's got the road, mate. Yeah, I, I actually don't. Oh, dislike. he was actually in a com he was completely north there. Yeah, he is max north or oh. max east, but both players. I think. Gingy is considering sticking well, where he's, he's at, but he's also well, looking he at the southeast coast of foul. Oh, oh foul! My God, that is the way you start a round one foul. in NMPZ. 1.1k, close to the 5k. Knowing for the foul. random white road and you know that is probably that the plantation there that y y is not always. Uh, I'm speechless. I mean, that's just a foul moment that right there. That was exciting because Gingy was also looking at it, yeah. but he was hovering Well, he was plonked in the northeast, and that's what he stuck with. Yeah, and even Gingy's guess more and west. And he's bitten. Wasn't, I mean, foul still would have picked up a little more points there, but listen, only 1,200 points. Let's keep it going. Mr. T, Mr. T. This is this is where <laughs> legends are made. This is the NMPZ still shot we get right here in aye, round two. Aye, aye, aye. The, the, the action. That this game provides. Some would not believe it. Tell your friends, tell your family, as Seltzer has been reminding us. If you're locked in, if you're a fan, anyone close to you could be as well. And we should share this joy, share this action. I love this the Baja. unique niche that we can reveal to the world. We have one Baja, we have one Sonora. Big points actually for here for someone. I mean, Jinji confidently locked in Baja. And he's right. Oh, what? Gingy now! Oh. And with 1.5x, is 2.2k uh, They said, you want a show, Paula? We'll give you a show. Oh, everyone at home, I was just pacing, kind of looking at the floor there, not really massively paying attention to the round. It had just started. I look up, all of a sudden the round's over, and Gingy bounces back. Gingy, one of the best oh. Mexico players in the world. We saw him 5k, or 4997, a random road in Mexico yesterday. And this is uh, this, this is what we get in, in, with Gingy in Mexico. He's one of the best Mexico players in the world. If you're foul, you do not want Mexico. But do you want New Zealand again? Let's see what we have here. This is the NMPZ. Holiday Park. I don't feel like I'm on holiday right now. I'm feeling the stress. I'm feeling the pressure, Trevor, that Gingy and Fowl are under right now. Gingy is going to use that Christchurch. Though. He's in like Christchurch. Like a pressure valve. He wants to release. And when you zoom in that, qu that quickly, you have to be conf confident in it. G just going Christchurch here. What does he see? Fowl. A more laid back approach. Calculating. We've seen this with foul before. You know, you you let the clock tick down. You use every single second you can. Scanning. Not 360ing. Not moving because he can't. He's locked in. All he's got is the image in front of him. Two X damage. Round three. Thirty seconds down. And he's Gingy's scanning North Island now. He's switched to just north of Wellington, and foul is still just browsing, analyzing the screen, not sure where he wants to guess. And we do see Gingy. Coming to his senses here and going North Island. Foul. And we have a Wellington guest here. With 10 foul. seconds left. Is he going to lock it in though, Trevor? Oh, oh, wait. He's thinking it could be oh, South wow. Island. Okay, this could be a big difference here. 2x damage. They're still pretty close. They're still pretty close. He's staying okay. north. He's yeah, staying no, north. I see it. He stayed north. He did. I stand corrected. Ooh. But it will be Gingy doing a bit of damage here. Not too much though. Not too much. Just a little bit. Just a little. You want to talk a little bit of damage, though. How about we talk about the next round? Okay, well, is this Russia? It looks like it should be Russia. Okay, everybody at home. Big country, big points. Let's get it trending. It should be. I'm not... Maybe it's... It could be Ukraine, actually. I'm actually not too sure on the 50-50 here. As is often the case, this could be tough for our competitors. Gingy, straight away. Can you know the road in just five seconds, young man? That would be uh, quite the flex. I would be 
I mean, we'll see. 15 down now. Does he want to lock it in? No. Not yet. He's refining. Moving his marker foul. Once again, taking his time before he opens that map, Trevor. 33 seconds. I mean, this is just constant or classic foul gameplay by just letting the clock run and really taking in every single pixel on that screen, every single tree branch, every single speckle on that road. You, there is no car antenna or meta for this, so this does make region guessing Russia that much harder. But again, we see kind of similar guesses, but still in Russia, that could be big points. 10 seconds. They're so close still though for Russia. So I don't think we see game Five. here. Let's see. Both laughing. Neither know, and they Moscow. actually do end up similar distances. Foul will be a bit close with 2.5x, it's 318 damage. Moscow. Moscow, Moscow, Moscow. All right, round five. For someone to win. But what? I, I wanted to hear what they said. Yeah, it's it's eavesdrop. Them. I just heard something win. Something about wins, right? Yeah, I'm not sure. Well, they're having a good time yeah, yeah, yeah. on the server, which is good to see. Yep. Let's see if they're having a good time in round five. An honorable duel. This is the NMPZ. I'm zooming to my screen here. That looks like it could potentially be a green sign in the distance there. And if that is that green sign, that could be Southern Malay, which would mean it's Johor. I th right, I think you get those yellow signs in Johor. If that is what I'm seeing, I can't quite make it out in the distance. We have a Saba, oh, wait. Wait, we have a Borneo guest here. We have Foul, wait. I think Foul's that- Foul's locked in. Is that this, the South of Malaysia? That's, yes. So they're both in Malaysia, one's in Borneo, one's in mainland. Jinji, if someone's right, and I think it might be oh, foul. Oh yeah, I'm seeing now. Oh no. They're broken by oh. a body of water, oh, but funnily enough. Oh my God. But with triple damage, no. 2.1, 2.1K, that's a walk. huge hit. I couldn't read the map there. I was a bit confused as to where Jinji was, and then I yeah. saw it separated by that body of water. Yeah, so that's Borneo Island and the mainland, and it's, wow. I mean, foul has, 1,000 points left to his name to make it to the finals, Paula. That's past the halfway point, and now Jinji in the lead. Well, I mean, you know, Jinji did get the, the Borneo vibes there, but he just, he just went more north. But that's, you know, it happens at NMPZ. And, you know, for a tournament that hasn't had a single New Zealand round this entire tournament, we've had a lot recently. Yeah, we have. And we're back. It's all coming up New Zealand. On day three of the America's Does Regional Finals. Fowl's, this is his Fowl's road end here in New Zealand. One minute. And you Jinji can see he's not happy going with it. straight in. Maybe that last round has lit a fire beneath him. And he wants to get across those coals as fast both, as possible. Oh, they're so close, Paula. They're so close. So close, but 3.5x damage. Yeah, Every little helps and Fowl is just on 1.1k life. It could be a big round. It could be the final deciding round, Trevor. It could be with 30 seconds less left. Bout is locking Foul in. Foul locks in first. How he close? He shrugs. He says, your move, brother. What they're, are you going to do? They're bantering. They're Gingy so close says, to each other. I'm going to do so this. Close. I don't think Foul can lose left. a thousand points here, though. I really, it could be. He's going more north. It could be. Oh, is that ever? Is I enough? don't think that's enough, Paula. That is, should not be enough. Oh. It's not. Oh Lord. 476 oh, on foul. Three rounds remaining. He stays alive. Gingy gets closer, but foul can certainly hit back. With these multis, anything is possible, Trevor. Who will advance to the finals to play Orlando. Decides oh, Orlando in next waiting four in rounds. the wings. What will round seven? Orlando give us? probably practicing his incantations, <laughs> writing his magic spells, hoping that he has what's needed in the final, but right now we do not know who he's gonna play. Let's find out in these next couple rounds. We'll know within a couple of minutes here, round seven. Sweden, potentially, yeah, Sweden. What well, better way to end it than where we are right now? We have the short dash white outer lines. It feels just seemingly north here with these trees though. America's regional finals, day three, coming to you live from Stockholm, Sweden. But and where in they're Sweden talking to each other. are we now? They both know it's Sweden, and they're both bantering, and, and we just see Jinji just clicking middle here. Both players having fun with it. And, and, and Foul does not want his fate Foul to come needs down to Sweden. to make sure that he is as close as possible. Oh my god, dude, they're so close again. With only 476 HP remaining. If it's slightly more north, Foul will be closer. If it's slightly more south, Jinji will be closer. Any mistake will be punished, Trevor. 
where will foul commit? He's clicking just on the word Sweden. <laughs> and Sweden. You, you have to respect it. 20 seconds left. And they're they're so close, Paula. They are close, but 476 HP with 4x multi. It comes down to this. This could be the game if Jinji has just done enough. Foul needs to be slightly closer here to continue it. Jinji just needs to be slightly closer. Not in here. Who is it, Paula? Trevor, we're about to find out. It's, oh, oh he's, he's still in it. He keeps himself alive. Oh my God. A cat with nine lives. And you should have committed north there with those trees. He's going to need at least scared. three more. At least that didn't wow. Finish the game. Oh, they're still talking. Let's eavesdrop. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. Wow. NMPZ, this is getting, I mean, what more do you want? What more do you want, Paula? Rounds eight, nine, and 10 is what I want. Well, let's give it That's to you then. That's what I want, brother. Let's see what round eight is. Ooh, fun. South Africa. South Africa. Do you win by just clicking Pretoria is the question. Round eight with 4.5 X damage. If and Jinji wins this, he goes undefeated into the final, just like Orlando. If Foul wins, he arguably takes out one of the biggest surprises in the tournament both, in Jinji. They're both near the same exact road once again. Oh my. In that west region of Pretoria. Oh, Foul locks it in. He's locked in. Oh, but are you close enough? There's so, 10 seconds left and we'll, we'll know. Will Foul still be in it? Thou shrugging. Jinji doesn't know. It's someone. Someone's going. Uh, is Thou stay is it? alive? Is Thou going? Or has Jinji done it? Jinji oh, might have done it. Be it. That should be it. Jinji, he's done it. You've done it, brother. Just like Orlando, who you'll be playing in the finals. You go four to zero. You take out Thou, and you earn your spot in our final matchup. Well, Thou did what he could. And it was a highly contested game, but it's the new generation that reigns supreme today. Mm. And that's what our grand final will be, that the is. battle of the new gen.